if you're looking to manually organize and order these particular areas on the Google site sidebar, the easiest way I've found is you've got to do a couple of things first. You have to go to more, go down to edit site layout, then you're going to get this weird kind of thing and everything will highlight. If you go down here where it says navigation, click on navigation, and see where it says automatically organize my navigation. That is what automatically puts the sidebar in alphabetical order. So if you unclick that, you're going to get this particular page list. And what you do is you take the page you want and you can move it up and down, kind of like this. And you can put it in any order you want. I wanted it to smell out to spell out smart down the side. So I put it in S-M-A-R-T for a project. But you can also indent these and it'll change that it's under that particular one. So you can just edit where how far in you want it. And when you're done, you click OK. And then if you give it a minute, it will switch back. See, now mine says smart down the side. So that's the order I have it in. And you're always going to have this site map at the bottom. You kind of can't get rid of that. I tried. And then when you're done with that, you hit close. Now, if you make a new page after this, if you click the new page and you, you start a new page, it will not show up over here right away. So what you have to do is you go to new page, and we are going to title this, we'll just title it test and create reading okay so this is test see how it's not on the sidebar yet it's just not over there we're gonna hit save so it just saves as a test page and then we're going to go to more edit site layout come over here highlight and click on navigation. Okay, then you have to go into add page. So you're going to click on add page and it's going to come up with this list of every page you've created. And it's just in alphabetical order. It's always going to put these in alphabetical order. But we just created test. We're going to click on that and hit OK. See now all of a sudden it's there and I can move it to wherever I want. And we're going to indent this just so it says it's test, so you can see what that is. Click OK. And give it a second. And there it is. See how it's indented? It's considered a... I can just indent it to wherever I want. Well, let's close this so it stops looking so weird. So it'll say Smartful, and then we have test. So it'll read as a sub-page to my main page. And that's all there is. So, hope that helped.